Hello and welcome to another Jira administration tutorial. In this tutorial, I'm going to talk a bit more about screens and how you can associate those screens with different operations and the issue type as well. So in previous tutorial, we have learned into in detail how you can create a screen then associate it with the screen scheme and associate that screen scheme with different project and issue type so uh, basically in last tutorial we didn't cover much around the association with the issue type so we'll cover with the issue uh, association of the screen scheme with issue type as well and a bit um, bit detailed discussion around that so uh, i'm going into the jira administration section so click on um, issues and we created the screen already and the new screen we created was rop bug screen new right let me edit it so that i'll just say new bug screen rather than bug screen new all right so i have updated that now this screen is already created and I have removed a couple of fields from this new bug screen right now coming back to the screen schemes what you can do in screen scheme is basically when you add a screen scheme then you can associate the screen with that scheme okay so we created the bug screen scheme new and then we configured that screen scheme and associated the issue uh, associated associated the screen with that right so at the moment you can see all the issue operations are basically using this same screen and from the screen scheme you can define which issue operation uses which particular screen there will be scenarios in the organization wherein you will be required to have a different screen for create edit and view issue and in those sort of scenarios you have to configure different screens for each of these operations and associate those screens from this screen so for example you have a different screen for create you associate it with create you have a different screen for edit you associate it with edit and you select that new screen that you will create so for example new bug screen that you create and you associate that with this uh, edit and if you add it then edit issue will have this particular new screen um, then coming back to the issue type screen schemes which we want to cover in more detail so um, what you can do from here is you can define which issue type use which screen scheme all right so for example your defect uses a different screen scheme and your story and epic use different screen scheme so that is possible in jira as well so you can define which screen scheme is used by which um, which it now what you need to do is so here you can see that scrum issue type screen scheme is there which has the project rcv academy online portal what i'll do is i'll click on configure and once you click on configure you will see that there is an association of the issue type with the screen scheme right so bug screen scheme new is the screen scheme um, that we created which has underlying screen new bug screen all right and then all other default issue types are using default screen scheme so i can associate an issue type so for example for an epic i want my new screen uh, new screen say bug screen scheme new and add Right, so this is just for an example ideally what you will do is you will have a separate screen scheme for epic and you will say epic screen scheme and then associate that with the issue type as epic so in when you associate that what will happen is for whenever you go to create an epic the new screen will appear for the epic so for example here if i click on create now and click on epic now you can see it has very limited number of fields or exactly the same fields that were associated with the uh, defect 
right so for the defects or the bugs we had same number of fields and for epic you can see similar number of fields in the screen i'll cancel it out and then go back to the issues again and you should type screen schemes and click on configure so i'm back on the same screen i'll click on delete this and you go back and create the epic now and you will it will be a lot more fields because it is using the default uh, scrum screen scheme right so that is uh, basically how you associate the issues to a new uh, screen scheme now to reiterate what we have learned in this tutorial we have learned how you can associate a new issue type or uh, an issue type with the screen scheme so in previous tutorial we learned how to create a new screen associate it with the a new screen scheme and then with the project and in this tutorial we have uh, learned a bit more how you can associate a particular issue type with a particular issue or with a particular screen scheme as well so hope you like the video please do share and subscribe thank you for watching